hydrogen as a cure for death. Of course, it will not bring back the dead. But if you're close to death's door, and I mean close, even if you're on your last 24 hours, or you regress a little bit if you have stage 4 cancer, or if you're dying in the ICU or emergency room from sepsis. I've, in this past year, as I've been writing my hydrogen medicine book, there's quite a few cases in which a person, a, a patient, either one of mine, or people I hear about, have been right near death's door or given three weeks to live by the doctors, it's close enough. It seems like the closer you are to death's door, the more hydrogen will work, or the faster it will work. There was a case where um, a man was dying in his home. His wife was a doctor, or is a doctor, and uh, a friend of mine went over with a hydrogen machine. They hooked him up to the hydrogen and just let, ran it for hours. And he, the friend of mine noticed the change where the wife, the doctor, it took about six, seven hours before she noticed. Her husband began to brighten and then all of a sudden, he pulled the hydrogen out of his nose and got up out of bed and went to the bathroom. Came back and put the hydrogen on all by himself again. And about three, four hours later, the wife and my friend were, felt safe enough to go out shopping and leave the, the husband with the maid. I've just recently got a, read a case where a man who had uh, radiation treatments for cancer like 15 months ago, about nine months ago, also was given three weeks to live, going downhill, and then went on the hydrogen and had a remarkable recovery until the doctors changed his medication and wouldn't let him near the hydrogen anymore. I could go on and on, but in the future, for, for, it would save a lot of people's lives if that future came now, that ICU departments, emergency departments, and ambulances, that they change the whole concept, and instead of applying hydrogen, I mean oxygen, which is the most prescribed drug in hospitals was always given with hydrogen. It makes sense. If hydrogen can keep a diver alive almost 2,000 feet down in the deep sea, breathing 96% hydrogen and 4% oxygen, it's proof that under severe conditions Oxygen should always be given with hydrogen.